On the table today, we have LEGO DC Comics Superheroes Batman Gotham City Cycle Chase. And I was also able to track down those two ninja bikes that Tiny Chipmunk Squirrel took off with. Whatever his intentions were, I have no idea yet. But he left the bikes built by the fish tank, and we will always question what is going through Tiny Chipmunk Squirrel's mind. He's just crazy. Set number 76053, Batman Gotham City Cycle Chase. 224 pieces with three minifigures. On the back of the package, some images of some of the amazingly awesome bat grapple things that this set can do. If you are interested in seeing the Batman Gotham City Cycle Chase builds, jump on over to the LEGO Ninjago Ninja Bike Chase review, as the fallout from Tiny Chipmunk Squirrel's terror still continues. Let's be smart about this and actually review the toys that the video is labeled after. We have Harley Quinn and Batman ready to go. Harley Quinn looks to be in her new Suicide Squad-like look. Red and blue bike, really quite striking and fun. We have a hammer on the side that she can play a little croquet with Batman's bike. Sorry, Batman. Good looking Harley figure again, red and blue, very striking. I like this design. I don't think I have a Harley Quinn Lego minifigure, so it's kind of a good one to add to the DC collection. Uh, two faces on her. We've got the smile, mischievous, happy, crazy clown face, and then we have the more I'm angry, I'm going to hit you Batman face. Good to have a little bit of options with her. Some interesting exhaust ports coming up here, and you can kind of shoot them down for, what, extra speed? Real fun little bike, huge wheel up front, big and red, and a little smaller wheel in the back, probably for doing some crushing of sorts. Fun little vehicle. Then we have the Bat Cycle. Always fun to have more Batman gear. This cycle has lots of tricks as usual. We have two side firing stud weaponry guns that fire. Wow, that one hit the light. And a nice little spot to put a batarang. And another stud weapon over here with his uh, grapple hook too that he can take out and use for bat-like things. Wheels on each side are about the same size though. Batman built stuff to last, bat sticker, all that sort of thing. Little gliders on the bottom to keep these driving smooth. Each one has that. Might even drive well on carpet actually. A good looking cycle. I suppose this is a little extra rocket blaster on the back for some extra boost or maybe just a bat signal like light to tantalize people into following him into some sort of elaborate bat trap. Interesting little piece there. I like how it glows. That cool amber piece really is very shiny. What is nice about these two sets is that it feels like you're getting two toys and you could probably take them apart and build some sort of car-like vehicle too if you are clever. Great sets for the DC Comics superhero Lego set worlds. And perhaps the real reason Tiny Chipmunk Squirrel absconded with the Ninjago bikes was to remind us that there were two really nice cycle sets going on in the March 1st, 2016 release of LEGO sets. And now we can see them all together looking just terrifically cyclerific great. And somehow, through reasons of complete confusion, we have the fast builds of the Ninjago bikes as well.
Let's take a look at Kai Spike first. Red and knifey spiky. Seems to be a well symmetrical balance to it. A little bit low to the ground, but there is a slider down there. We've got two swords coming out the side so they can kind of pull out and do some serious damage in a drive-by. I like that feature. We also have some little pretend weaponry, I believe, on the side here. Kind of like how the, there's a little flame here. Take the sword off here, and it kind of feels like the flame is coming out of this pipe in some way. I like that. Things are falling off now. And it's about repeated the same way on each side of the bike. Cool exhaust on the back here. Probably keeps the back of your back quite warm. Good looking red cycle. Then we have Naya cycle here, and it is a real low rider. There's not much ground going on. There's not even room for carpet sliders on this thing, so she's not going to be able to hit much of anything or things are going to go bad quickly. I almost wonder if you could uh, flip these uh, wheel pieces around maybe. You might actually be able to do that. Take this front and this front, this back here I mean, and do some flipping and give her some more clearance if you're into that. Yeah, see, doing that gives you some clearance. Lego is all about customization, right? Okay, <laughs> Oh, there we go. Now her bike's a little bit too high, but it's kind of funny that you can do that. It's not really planned, but I kind of like doing that. Interesting front, interesting uh, handlebars as well. Uh, these two sidebars that come out and she can grab onto with uh, sticker controls on the front panel. And I think one of the coolest things about this set is the layering of the fins back here on these little spiky sword things that come out of these pipes in here. Uh, three on each side, just layered, and they look really cool how they did that. I like that a lot. So a great looking bike for Naya. I think I'm actually gonna flip these back now. It's a little imbalanced having them up, but maybe you can do a little bit of just having one up and one uh, down if you want that kind of weird look so great little vehicle the set also comes with the pirate skiffy and his flying trash can dropping uh, bomb thing these kind of neat little round bombs with a flame on it old school stuff I like that and you can kind of rotate these wings around it he stands well with it kind of like that because of the thruster on the back looks like something Boba Fett would fly around with and even kind of a similar Boba Fett color scheme, isn't it? Kind of, not always, but good looking figure to have and nice little extra to the set. Lego DC Super Heroes Batman Gotham City Cycle Chase and Lego Ninjago Ninja Bike Chase both appeared on store shelves March 1st, 2016. Lots of good bikes to pick up this spring. Obviously, if you are a fan of superheroes, pick up Batman and Harley Quinn, and if you are a fan of ninjas, pick up the Ninjago bikes. That's what I have to say about that. Hey, you should try reviewing those sets separately. Oh wait, you did. Thanks for watching Squirrel Stampede. Please, like, share, subscribe.